hello friends my name is ankush in this video we are going to see how to start stop and reload the listener as we know listener is useful when there is new connection is establishing from the application user or from other side as the name describe of the listener it is listening to the new connection so let me take it in a practical way so that you can understand in order to check the listener status from the os level or if you want to check the listener if the listener is running or not on the process level then we have the command as a ps hyphen em grip tns so as of now i am not seeing any listener is running now first of all we will start the listener to start the listener we need to connect to the ls nr ctl utility which is available inside the bin directory I have already set my environment. Let me set it again. So, to check the status of the listener, first of all, l s n r c t l. Okay. Now, I am inside the l s n r c t l prompt. To check the status of the listener, we have status. Then. we need to mention the listener name l i s t e n e r by default the listener name will be listener and the port it is using 1521 if you are not mentioning the listener name here then also there is no issue if the condition is the listener name should be listener if the listener name is different apart from the listener then you need to manually mention the name after the status okay here by using the status it is checking the status of the listener it is showing as there is no listener running no listener running okay we can check the status without going to the ls nr ctl command prompt like this ls n r c t l status see here i have not mentioned the listener name because the default listener for me is a listener only it is showing the status as there is no listener let me start the listener ls n r c t l then start listener name l i s t e n now it is starting the listener okay let me check this listener status again ls nr still now it is showing see previously we were getting that list there is no listener now we are not seeing any kind of the error but it's showing as no services because the services is not registered as of now okay in order to stop the listener we are using the command lsnrctl is the utility and then stop listener name here if we are checking the status now again we are getting the same state error saying there is no listener let me check in another way still i am not seeing anything let's say we have made some changes to the listener file and then in order to reflect that changes we need to st stop and start the listener instead of doing this thing we can also reload the listener let me show you 
let me start the listener first and to reload the listener that's it now the listener file whatever we have update to the listener file that thing you can see after reloading it okay if i am checking it on a process way tns now here i can see this thing previously it was blank see now once we have started the listener you can see the processes and the file which is associated to it here okay one more thing which i want to highlight here there is no connection between the oracle database services with the listener services if you are stopping the oracle database it doesn't mean that it will start the oracle uh, listener services let me come in, come up it again there is no relationship between the oracle services oracle database services and the listener services let me show you in a practical way if i have see here i am connecting to the database let me check the database status my database name is prime and currently it is up and running okay now i am stopping the database although i am stopping the oracle database services you won't find any thing happening on the listener services still you will find the listener services is up and running see here let me check it in another way see currently listener is up and running okay listener is mainly come up with the role when the new connection is coming once the new connection is established the role of the listener is finished over there okay that's it um, in this video we have seen how to start stop and reload the listener uh, i will come up with the next video please subscribe and like my channel to stay tuned thank you so much for training you can contact me anytime bye bye